Today, I am going to open your eyes because many people today have become addicted to fornication. You still don't know how it can affect your health. Islam has forbidden adultery, and there are many reasons behind it. Due to these reasons, adultery has been forbidden in Islam. I will tell you some facts today about when it is permissible and when it is forbidden. I will also discuss the punishment for adultery. Listen carefully. Adultery is one of the major sins in Islam. Before I explain further, it is important to know that the Prophet peace be upon him said, If a married man and a woman commit adultery, stone them both. This is a punishment from Allah. In other words, it means that there is a kind of penalty, and when an adulterer commits adultery, he is out of faith. The punishment for adultery in this world is severe. The most dangerous punishment is that you become accustomed to it, and it will destroy your life. If you do not leave this sin, you will face a painful punishment that will leave you devastated. Once a habit is formed, it becomes very difficult to quiet. I am only talking about punishment in this world, but the punishment that Allah has placed in the hereafter is even more dangerous than you think. Now many people want to leave this sin, but it has become very difficult to seek shelter from it. Islam gives importance to marriage and does not allow adultery. Islam has banned it, but adultery has become common in society. At this point, the only one left is the one who doesn't get a chance. Otherwise, adultery has become very common. However, those who fear Allah are safe. Those whose faith is very powerful do not even come close to such a sin. But don't despair, there is a way by which you can be saved from such a sin forever. If you have any sinful habit, or if you are suffering from any sin, start letting go of this sin slowly. If your heart turns towards Allah, then pray to Him immediately. If you get into the habit of letting go, you will gradually start to abandon the sin. A time will come when you will be freed from the sin. You have to make this a habit. Otherwise, there are many people in the world today who have been destroyed by this habit and want to get out of it. And moreover, adultery is not permitted or allowed. We pray to Allah that may Allah save us from such sins and guide us on the right path.